Okay, what we've got here is a 2012 Outback Flamingo. Uh, it's got a broken cable that pushes one of these posts up to the top. Um, I rented it out on a website uh, to some people and it come back and they said, oh, it's, and I had to go down and get the thing up for them and um, yeah, yeah, I'm not too happy. It was in fine working order before I left and now I've got to deal with this, which never would have happened if I had been in charge. Oh well, you know. So I just thought I'd show this video to give people an idea of um, how this mechanism works. So you've got your main winch here that you drive from the front. That's as far as most people see. So it's just the crank there. That's how you lift it all up. And this is the mechanism here. It's just a basic winch. And it goes a single cable onto this turnbuckle, which has all four of your uh, smaller cables, which each go to a single post. There's a lot of tension. Um, so what's happened is uh, that cable goes back inside the this square tube, I'm pretty sure and connects with this little push block. And what's happened is, is that there's this fairly, you can see how the, the cables swaged um, around the end of these hooks. And what's happened in this case is they've over tensioned it and they've actually pulled the cable free of this little aluminium piece. So what I'm going to attempt to do if my cable's long enough, it doesn't look like there's anything that's ripped off it. I'm going to lower the top, feed that cable back through, uh, and hopefully there's enough length to be able to re-clamp this inside of that. So this has the open end out and goes inside that tube there and the cable pulls that forward as you wind and pushes your that springy looking push rod and pulls the uh, pushes the roof up hopefully it, it won't be any more complicated than that I'll do another video maybe and show you how I went all right, well, hopefully that kind of takes some of the mystery out of it. It's very easy to get at uh, because it's the front. I haven't tried to do the back. Um, but for the front, you just go into kind of this annex department here, annex compartment. And uh, there's this um, wall block here to hide it all. You just take that out. And uh, then you've got access to it. Well, cheers. Hope that's helped.